my god we're back another freaking weekend my life 3 43 in the morning and i'm freezing and i didn't wash my jacket that i wear every day so i'm gonna be freezing today and i'm so upset and i'm trying to let my car heat up so that i can fucking I'm so tired. I didn't go to sleep until like 10.30 and then I woke up so mad because yesterday I forgot to order my freaking notebooks offline so that they could be here today. So now they're not going to be here until tomorrow and I'm so stupid, but it's whatever. It's fine. I'm just going to have to live my life and I'm just so irritated about that. But this weekend, it's pretty freaking wild. Don't really want to talk about it. Kobe Bryant died. That was so sad and his daughter back here with a new freaking week back to the grind i have soul cycle today i'm definitely taking a nap though when i get off of work because i get up at 9 45 and i just love the days that i get up at 9 45 because i get to take a nap with no shame i also do need to do my i don't know i'll give you guys the full list of what i need to do when i get off of work because i'm gonna figure out on my break what i have to do let me fully put my shoes on now so i'm not that girl oh my god it's 3 45 i need to leave shout out to my mom for buying a car with um seat warmers because this ain't it dog got my bullet journal to um y'all i don't know what i'd do without my bullet journal i wouldn't be able to survive i'm scared that if i turn this heater on it's gonna shoot out cold air and not with that at all i will talk to you guys when i'm off of work or something like that i don't know all right guys i'm back um i'm not really gonna talk that much because there's music in the background and i'm not in control of it so i don't want to get copyrighted but i'm back at home i'm about to eat my rice cereal and probably take a nap and then get up and do some meal prep do some homework all that yeah i will talk to you guys when i wake up from a nap <laughs> all right guys it's now 5 17 i just finished editing my birthday vlog while doing the the rough cuts and the jump cuts but i have to go to soul cycle now so i'm just gonna make my pre-workout and put my clothes in the laundry room and then head over to soul cycle and then i'm gonna come back and finish this vlog and then i'm pretty I'm gonna be hungry by then though cook some dinner I feel like that was my first time actually actually taking pre-workout and I did not know it has you feeling like this like I feel so itchy I feel it in my face I feel it in my hands I feel it in my thighs I feel it in my feet I'm just so itchy but I'm so pumped and I'm starting to go so I go in I didn't know that this is what pre-workout makes you feel like and I feel like I'm talking so freaking fast and I'm so sorry but I will be there in 12 minutes as, okay my light's green goodbye Oh my god guys that class i literally look a freaking chocious but that class was literally insane that class was so good that was like one of the best soul cycle classes i've ever been to she was so freaking amazing and there wasn't that many people in the class so that's what just made it so much more fun yeah my dad's calling me oh, shoot my phone doesn't work hello hello can you hear me hello hello he can't hear me He can't hear me. I'm in the garage. I told him that I was in the garage. I guess one of the guys there brought white claws for everybody. So, you know, your girl's 21 now. Obviously, I'm not gonna drink this and drive. My dad keeps calling me and he knows I'm in the garage. Hello? Hello? He can't hear me. Dad, I'm in the garage. You can't hear me. Oh, yeah. Dad. He cannot hear me. He's in keep calling me. And now he's facetiming me he can't hear me i'm just gonna recap with you guys when i talk to jelly because he's just gonna keep calling me because i'm real service pull the key out the ignition while i'm sitting here waiting for you know to export i feel like i should this is my first white claw ever so i'm gonna try it it's eight o'clock on a monday night because i'm 21 so cheers to that nope nope not a fan. I don't like that. I'm not a fan. Maybe because it's black cherry is why I don't like it, but I don't think I'm gonna finish that. That's... I'm gonna stick to my water. This is... I don't like that. Sorry, and I'm gonna finish uh, editing because I didn't like that. 
here with Jelly guys. We're about to cook dinner. I wasn't being very helpful because I was trying to finish this vlog, but I edited the thumbnail and I really want Jelly to watch it to see if it's good. No, well, she's just sitting around doing nothing. That's not the case. It's nine o'clock and I'm still trying to get this vlog up because I definitely said that I was gonna upload every Monday and Saturday and I've uploaded on a Saturday one time. <laughs> That's it. Get your stuff together. I know, but I really like this vlog. This is really one of my favorite vlogs that I feel like you can really see my family and how my, oh, she's cute. Apricot jam. I'm kind of scared. We're having sweet heat shrimp tempura bowl. I'm excited. I really hope it's spicy, because if it's not, I'm gonna be up. Well, there's so. Korean chili flakes right there that are kind of scaring me. <laughs> that are kind of scaring you, but um, yeah, it's 9.02. I have five minutes until my vlog exports and then I need to upload it. But I never listen You hold me back We'll never last Keep talking all your shit Wondering how all this started You left me broken hearted You flip my words Yeah, this love hurts Keep talking all your shit Oh, keep talking all your shit, baby Your words, they're driving me crazy all right, well, Jelly and I just finished watching my birthday vlog and eating this delicious dinner. I'm not done yet, but I'm gonna leave and be back to finish my dinner. And, because I just know my dinner's just gonna be so much better when I come back. You're so irritating. But, uh, yeah, any final words? Dinner was great. It was really, really good. Cool. So freaking good. Okay, let me hurry up so he can yeah. stop texting me. It is goose day, February 22nd. It's 9.10. I'm class in like about an hour. I'm kind of feeling good. I got the sweetest message of my whole entire life last night. And I just, like it really just, it made my whole semester. I swear to God, I'm going to get a tattoo. Uh, one of the things that he said, he's one of the sweetest people I've ever met in my whole entire life. And I just really cannot believe I'm not this person. But yeah, I'm just going to start packing up my bag, getting ready to leave. I'm going to come back, straighten up my room a little bit after class and then I need to go print out my French homework and do that before class and take some notes on one of my other classes. Hopefully my notebooks come today so that I can start on my online class. <sighs> Here goes Alexa when I wasn't even talking to her and I did not say her name. Yeah, that's kind of how today's going. So I need to leave in like the next 20 minutes so that girl does not take my seat because I'm not playing about my seat this semester. No. And then I need to do another load of laundry. So yeah, today is really going to be a school day. Literally, you're probably just going to keep seeing montages of me doing homework. And today's my long day. I'm not out of class until like 15, which is kind of annoying. And I can't like spend that much time on homework when I get out of class because I have work tomorrow at 6. Third. But then after I get off of work, I have more time to do homework. I haven't really, I'm not really sure how I'm going to fit in working out. I know for sure I'm going to go to Soul Cycle and boxing every week, but like I still want to be able to go to the gym, but I just don't know how to balance that yet. So maybe in like a week or maybe next week if we can figure it out. But right now I'm just not 100% sure how to balance school and working out, but working out class is just way easier because it's just very structured. So I don't know, but I'm done rambling and I will talk to you guys. I don't know. So enjoy these montages because I'm pretty sure you're going to get a lot of them today. All right guys, I'm back from class. It was pretty good class. Um, I submitted my thousand hours of work experience, so I'm one step closer to graduating, which I'm super excited about. I got this random DM talking about I saw your boyfriend on Tinder, and I was like, excuse me, but it turned it out. I'm not gonna put his business out there, but it was not my boyfriend. It was somebody who's very close to me, related to me. Somebody thought that I was his girlfriend, and I was like, that no, no way. <laughs> There's no way. That's not my boyfriend. Will never be my boyfriend. Never had the opportunity to be my boyfriend. No, but I just thought it was really funny. So I messaged him and I was like, yo, brisky, look. <laughs> but yeah, I just printed out my French homework. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to take some notes. So have fun watching that. Baby, your words are driving me crazy. Keep talking all your shit, baby. It is 
3.59 and I'm going to go make my way down to the office so that I can go get my notebooks because they finally came and I'm really excited about that. And then I'm going to go off to my French class and then after French, I got home my class and then I'll be back. Hopefully, Jelly will cook dinner because I don't get out of class until 8.15. <laughs> That's that. I will see you guys either with a montage or when I'm out of class. It's 8.15 and I'm home now. I'm pretty sure I'm the only one that's home. I've been doing a laundry 2.0 and I'm going to take my test or my hospitality class because it's due by 11.59. <laughs> but I did a lot. My hand hurts so much from my knee. I'm literally going to show you guys how much I freaking wrote today. My hand hurts so bad. Mind you, I didn't even do all the writing I was supposed to do today. Are you getting in the shower? Why would you call me then? I, I didn't. Yeah, okay, whatever. Anyways, have them on you. Yeah. Okay. Gone. Okay. Okay, this is misleading. I didn't write that today. Where did I start from? From today. Uh, here. All this. Like, are you kidding me? And then I had to redo my French notes. That's only two pages. But still, I'm annoyed. That's still a lot. I'm gonna go because I'm on FaceTime. I need to take this test. So I'm stressing. I only have 15 minutes to take this quiz and I'm pretty upset about it. I don't know what I'm about to do. Why is she only giving 15 minutes? I'm so mad. I'm so mad. I probably should have closed my window before I closed my blinds, but I'm stressed. All right, I got a nine out of 10, but you know what? It's whatever I try, that's all that freaking matters. That's still like a B, right? What's the, what's the A? It's a 90, it's a low A, but it's an A. I'm gonna go cook dinner and then start getting ready for bed because we got work in the morning. I just finished dinner all by myself because Jelly hates me and she left me to cook dinner all by myself. Yeah. No, I'm just kidding. That's how it happened. I'm going to finish laundry 2.0. Don't look at me like that. Fold laundry. And go to sleep. And Jelly's letting me have some of her drink because I finished all three of my drinks. I saw three of them left. I only drank one of them. That's crazy because last time Jelly drank all of hers before I could even finish mine. I in like two days. Right, but I but I still feel like I spaced that because we haven't been to Trader Joe's in like right. a week, you, you like over a week. I did a great that's like job. The and that's the only like Jelly still has other stuff to drink. That's the only thing I had to drink. So you know I've what? Been down in no shame in my game, but I I'm so excited because even though yeah, I've been snacking on them because they're so good. It's like kind of spicy. I can't tell if it's spicy because of, like I have residue on my fingers or if it's just spicy. I don't really have a reason to go to 7-Eleven unless I have another movie night. Mind you, I still yeah, it's backwards. What? Why would I need backwards? It's football season. I told you it's oh, yeah. not gonna happen again until like winter break. You need to remind me the next time I go over to his apartment to get our popcorn things back yeah. because I forgot them over there, both of them. Yeah, we even have a movie night. have burgers. They don't really look that good, but I hope they taste really good. I'm not going to do a close-up of it because it doesn't look that good, but I had like a little bit of everything while I was cooking it and it tasted delicious. Let's Peace out. The she smashed it down, but it was so, so big. Go take a bite. Let's I'm see. To oh, let me smash it back though. Look at all that juice. Okay, I think the technique I'm gonna use here is a quick one. Don't get a close up. You need to back up. Okay, I'll stand this far. Yeah, you make a sound effect. Is it good? Does it taste like anything? 
like a burger you've had before, just like a regular burger. This is the most intense burger we've had from HelloFresh. There's a lot going on. I know there's, what is in there? There's tomatoes, pickles, onions, oh. mayo, oh. sour cream. There's a lot of stuff in there. Okay, I'm gonna go eat. I'm literally for work. I don't know why, because I went to sleep. Oh my God, this battery's gonna die. But I went to sleep at like 10, so I don't know why. I was so tired and it took me forever to wake up, but I'm gonna go down and go now because this battery's gonna die and I didn't get a new battery. So we'll see you guys when I'm back at home. Well, we're gonna hurry up and talk again because I left the battery or I left the, whatever this is called. How? In the car all day. <laughs> First of all, I, I never know how to. This is why I don't like parking here. Anyway, we're going to get. All right, guys, it is Thursday at 9:24. I am on my way to class. The camera died yesterday. Yesterday, I was just having a really rough day. I'm like, so tired of being on my period, and I'm so tired of birth control. Birth control just has me all over the place. But that's what happens when you have a irregular period and it needs to be regular i don't know i should i need to go to class and then i can need to come back and i need to do so much freaking homework because i have to go to work and i just want to let y'all know all y'all out there who don't have to go to work and only have to go to school privilege because trust me i would do anything to only have to go to school and not to have to work as well because this is so stressful all i want to do is do my homework but then guess what i gotta go to work because i gotta pay bills i'm so over it over it um, we're gonna go to class be a good student but yeah i'm gonna go to class and then come back and then tell you guys my to-do list for the rest of the day and then we're gonna go from in there so i'll see you guys when i'm out of class what? i have something to tell you what i just got hired at the mandalay bay to be a lifeguard my <laughs> It's going to be so fun! How much money? Oh my gosh, like Same. 11 something. Ah. It's way more than Starbucks. Like starting now? Like, I have to like do my lifeguard certification and then the pool opens in March. <laughs> Dude, I'm so excited. That's going to be so fun and you can like lead into it. Yeah, you can get into the company through there. Because the guy that I was talking to, he's a supervisor. And then he was, yeah, I started off as, he started off as lifeguard, then he went to Cabana host, and then he went to supervisor, all within like three seasons. Shit, really? And that's, their seasons are quick. Oh my god. Okay, I'm back after all that. You know, I had to call my family and let them know. But I just got hired on the spot on campus to be a lifeguard at Mandalay Bay for this summer. So I'm really excited about that. Then I'm starting to get a little stressed out because I've been a junior lifeguard before, but I haven't like, <laughs> I haven't been like swimming, swimming in so long. But yeah, so I have to get back into doing that. My dad's like, yeah, you need to start tomorrow. And I know he's gonna call me every day and check if I have done my swimming. So I have to start like swimming like every single day to start practicing. Cause I will, I'm gonna start my certification process on February 21st. So, and then that'll go, or yeah, and then that'll go up to March 1st and the pools open in March for the hotels on the ship. But I'm super excited about it. Yeah. So now I'm gonna do my French homework and do probably full clothes. I don't really know what I'm gonna do. Oh no, I made a list. I made a list. I'm gonna follow the list. But I also need to heat up my food. But to do list for today, I need to, well, I need to print out my French homework, which I already did, so checking that off. And then I need to clean my room, fold some laundry, clean my room, fold some laundry, and then I need to go to class, and then cook some dinner after I get out of class, and then I'm gonna just do my night routine to get it over with, and then I'm gonna start my homework so then I can just like fall asleep after I do my homework, instead of like doing my homework, then taking a shower and doing all that, so I'm just gonna do all that after I finish cooking. So, enjoy this montage of all these things that I'm about to do, and check them off one by one, but I'm so freaking excited. I'm not excited about like, getting back into the pool that much because now I'm gonna have to really start combing my hair and um, we all know how Maya feels about that. So it's gonna be a struggle. It's gonna be an adventure to Maya going into her natural hair journey because obviously I won't be able to go back Christ to Christine and get my hair, you know, planned every other month, <laughs> but it's fine. <laughs> We're gonna get through this together. We're going on this journey together and this gives me even more incentive to continue weekly vlogging because now I'm starting my journey into the hospitality industry and I'm so excited. I've been waiting for this for so long to get a job at one of the hotels on the strip and I feel like it's just gonna be such a fun job to work over the summer, like lifeguard at Mandalay Bay, what the heck? I mean, I'm gonna come back being black as ever, but 
it's gonna be worth it. So yeah, I wanna get started on that to-do list. Yeah, let's get this show the road. I never cared, keep talking all your shit. Oh, keep talking all your shit, baby. Your words that driving me crazy. Keep talking all your shit, baby. You know that. It's good. I think it's good. Okay, can very flavorful. Let me see your reaction. Well, let's see some person who doesn't like raviolis. I think it's good. I'm scared because I'm a picky eater. <laughs> We are a picky person, so we might not like it. Maybe each thing to eat? I don't like the inside of it. The spinach, um, it's it's too spinach. mushy, or like the cheese or something. It's too mushy. <laughs> <laughs> I also posted the snap that <laughs> he told me not to post. Maya, Maya, take it down. I'm telling your mom. <laughs> I told my mom I was gonna post it. <laughs> Maya, when you're crying. Honestly, I think I'm think I think I'm gonna be done this time. I'm being Shut serious. Up. Like after, okay, no, being so honest. Like after talking to Scott, like I really think I'm gonna be done this time. Like I think I'm just gonna like give it. Okay, maybe not done, but like a break, like a nice break, which we've never you done. Right, and you know, I'm gonna turn this off because don't need to know my business. Maya, you left camera sitting on the counter. Welcome to Vlogmas. Okay, bye. Love you, Maya. Say bye. Bye. Alright guys, it is 9.26 and I'm on my way to work and I'll come back so we can do my homework because I ended up leaving last night and having a really awkward conversation that I didn't want to have but I'm kind of glad I did have it and I just need to learn to express my feelings instead of just bottling them up and keeping them inside but we can talk about that later because I need to go to work but I'm still on a high about this job. I'm so excited but I will talk to you guys when I get back home. Alright guys, um, I did get to finish Friday. Honestly, I don't even know why I don't remember what happened yesterday, but clearly I didn't finish. But here I am on this nice Saturday evening and yeah, that's just a recap of my week. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Hopefully I will get better at fully recording my days and not just cutting it off in the morning but that is that and i hope you guys enjoy this week it was pretty freaking eventful if i do say so myself feel free to you know subscribe like comment i genuinely love when you guys comment it just makes me so happy especially when you guys find me on social media and then we dm and we just talk about everything and about life because i have no friends so it's just a great time when i talk to you guys so yeah because literally the only people i talk to are cookie and Nyjah, jelly and best friend that's it. So yeah, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this week and I'll see you guys next week. Mm -hmm.